Jesus is coming so very soon. I don't know why I keep feeling the urge to talk about this stuff, but I'm going to talk about it as long as I feel like I need to. All these professing Christians out here attacking one another, stirring discord among the brethren. That's one of six things that God hates, but they don't care. They have to be right. So they keep on arguing and fighting and debating. Same kind of professing Christians who tell everybody if you don't go to a church building, you're going to hell. Scripture says forsake not the gathering. For instance, my wife and I gather every day and read the Bible. And we talk about the Lord every single day. We're gathering. You don't need these buildings, these apostate buildings where they have concerts. And where the preachers are multimillionaires or you're paying for their mortgages and they don't help anybody they sit in the same building every Sunday and Wednesday talking to the same people over and over and over and I've seen a lot of them they'll go out here in public and they won't open their mouths I don't feel led to step foot back in one of those buildings everybody says the same thing to you too well my my church is not like that and then I try it. And it is like that. It's religious. Please stand. Please sit. Pass around a bowl. Make you feel guilty about tithing, which is part of the law. Wake up, church. Most of you have been too comfortable sitting behind these pews watching this man talk to you. And you don't even read the Bibles for yourselves. You're going to be caught off guard. Jesus is coming so very soon. Stop fighting stop debating love one another like my daddy used to say all this stuff going on right now and this is exact, exactly what my dad would say ray charles could see that jesus is coming soon and the united states of america will be utterly destroyed so many out here fighting about the rapture and all these other things why would you want to be left here this country is going to be destroyed, and it's mainly Americans doing this. It's time for a lot of you to get rid of this pride and look up and trust in Jesus. Read your Bibles. Stop leaning on your own understanding. And I know people still won't listen. And that's okay. Sometimes we need to learn to dust our feet. I just don't want to see anybody go to hell. But sadly, there'll be many as I've said before, y'all, I've been to that place. In 2002, when I overdosed, I seen hell. I don't wish that on anybody. Get yourselves spiritually ready because Jesus is coming any minute for the church. Romans 10, 9 through 13. I truly do love every single one of you. This is why I come here. God bless. Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah.